What's poppin' everybody? Good morning. We are back at it again with another workout this morning, surprisingly enough. Obviously, doing two workouts a week uh, is pretty normal for most people, so I'm going to be doing this morning. I'm not able to go to practice later this afternoon because I'll be filming all afternoon, so we're on our own this morning. going to head over to the rack to use the treadmill so I don't have to worry about pacing myself out on the track, and the track doesn't have lights, so it'll be a little rough, but yeah, let's get moving. All right, so getting ready for the workout, switching over the shoes, gonna toss the uh, heart rate monitor on and then get moving. But today we have uh, eight to 10 by a mile. I'm supposed to be going at 540 pace, but I don't think the treadmill actually has like a perfect 540 equivalent. So I think I'll either be doing the first three at 542 and then the last six, seven, depending on how much I do uh, at 539. I'm pretty sure that 542 and 539 are the two closest I can get to 540 pace. So that's probably what we'll be doing. Uh, obviously, you know, I'll update you guys as we go, but I'm thinking I'll probably jump on, do three back to back, and then give you guys a little update on how I'm feeling. Uh, I just don't really wanna go update after every single one because I only have a minute rest between each rep. So be a little difficult to update you guys after each one so i think i would do every three so after the third rep sixth rep ninth rep if i get that far and then obviously after the tenth if i do that as well so yeah I'm gonna switch over the shoes and get ready and knock out this workout Three miles down, uh, feel a little gassed, kind of need to take a shit, and uh, still have seven more to go, so that's pretty daunting. My heart rate just peaked at 171, which is way too early to be doing that, but my legs feel pretty good, so I know my heart's just being a little bitch. I got more in me. Let's turn up the heat. I realize you guys really can't see me, but I don't have enough time to move the camera. Six down, heart rate's a little high, around 175. Physically, I think you got four to six more reps than me, but that doesn't matter, because mentally, it's where it's all at. The heat is on, it's time to cook. Like Coach Gummerson would say, meat and potatoes are the workout right here. I don't eat meat, but I love some potatoes. Let's get after it. Okay, so post-workout, some of the audio failed for the 9th and 10th miles, respectively. So here's my update. Through 9 miles, I felt absolutely amazing. I was super confident going into that 10th mile because I had gotten through 9 already, and I didn't feel bad at all. Honestly, felt a little bit better after doing the first 3 and then 6 on after that. Also, Willie did end up joining me up on the top of the track, so shout out Willie. Uh, some of those clips were recorded by him, so what a great guy. Love that man. And yeah, honestly, just an amazing day. I ended up running this workout in streak flies, which don't have a carbon plate. And, you know, 
I was a little iffy about doing that, but I felt great doing it, and it was an awesome experience. Uh, I will be making a video about how I feel about the street flies, so look, be the lookout for that. But seriously, a great workout, the longest workout I've ever done being 10 miles. And yeah, I'm super proud of this workout, very happy with the effort I put in for sure. And, you know, 540 average with 60 seconds of rest is pretty solid, I'm not going to lie. I mean, it's nothing crazy, of course, but second workout back. I'm not going to complain with it whatsoever, and uh, yeah, like I said, I'm very happy with this workout. With that being said though, back to the vlog. Thank you so much. Have a good Friday. Are we in one? I'm currently sitting here. Girl, or you're just really weak. <laughs> um, okay, knock, knock. Who's there? Water. Water who? What are you doing asking so many questions? Just open the door. <laughs> that was a good one. Knock, knock. Just kidding, it's not a knock, knock joke. <laughs> what do you call... I forgot it. What do you call an alligator in the FBI? What? I don't know what. Anyone? An instigator? <laughs> All right. T for me. Coffee for Mama T, and we are on a little bit of a time crunch because I need to be back in 50 minutes to start recording the pre-game, basically, of rugby's game versus BYU for my documentary. So we got to get moving. So it's much later in the evening now. I'm calming down. I just ate dinner, got back to the house, getting ready for bed. Didn't film anything after the rugby game because I was just like, I, my emotions were all over the place watching the game. It was an amazing experience. And then I basically just crashed right after. So, you know, 10 mile workout this morning, we'll do that to you on top of just an intense game. That was such an amazing experience. I was so glad to be a part of it. Definitely an awesome time hanging out with the boys. So, so glad I got to experience it. And now I'm just exhausted. I'm getting ready for bed. I'm done with the night. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to head out. I will see you guys in the next video. I hope there will be another one for sure. I don't know what the next one's going to be yet, but we'll find out. With that being said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Any comments, questions, or concerns, drop them in the comments below. Let me know if you guys want to see something specific. And I will see you guys next time. Love all things and... Peace out.